is Barbara with Quartz Rose Tarot. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I upload new content. This reading is a general reading for the collective. It's what you need to know right now. What somebody needs to know right now. Let's get into this, guys, and see what's going on. Um, if you're looking for my information to book a personal reading or anything else, you'll find it listed in the description box. So let's get into this. What do you need to know right now? What's happening? You got unfinished business, but you may be at a crossroads. You have some regret. You may be heartbroken over a toxic relationship. There is some unfinished business here, but you are hesitant because it's toxic. You don't want to have any regrets here. You don't want to regret going back to somebody or something. Okay. You have to do something here, but you're hesitant to do it because if it's a toxic relationship, you don't want to have some regrets. Like, I, uh, man, I should have just let sleeping dogs lie, right? Because you feel like you're going to end up heartbroken here. Tell me about the collective. Give me all 12 signs. Guys, this is either who you're, uh, who's coming towards you or if you are. So I'm going to just do all 12 signs. Aries. Trying to move on, but still looking back at past mistakes. Taurus. This is the harsh truth about this relationship. If you're dealing or are a Gemini, there's a lot of drama in a family situation. Could be a toxic family situation too. Could be, it doesn't have, the relationship could be with a family member. Doesn't have to be a love reading, guys. Cancer. Somebody wants a victory over the past. Leo, you're trying to close out a karmic cycle. Virgo. It's been a long time since you've seen a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Libra. Your wish fulfillment is to walk away. Scorpio, you're back and forth about the betrayal. You're, you're back and forth about this betrayal. Sagittarius, the truth will come out in divine timing. Capricorn, you feel like you need to stand in your power or take control when it comes to a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Aquarius. Manifesting deception, deceptive illusion here. They might be doing witchcraft, guys. Pisces. It's illuminating a commitment. Let's get into this. Somebody, it looks like somebody's trying to reconcile. Somebody wants a new beginning, but the harsh truth is where this relationship was concerned. Somebody was wishing for love, but they're back and forth about the betrayal. They either want to start it anew or you feel like you have unfinished business in this situation.
Um, I feel like you're coming in as a pre empress energy here. This relationship, you may have not spoken to somebody for a long time, but you want that to transform. Somebody wants to rebuild here, but the other one, there's, it's almost like rebuilding, but passionately communicating about the tower. You do have some, someone either standing, standing their ground trying to make a decision for equal give and take, but there's that past mistake. They want to overcome an obstacle. Someone's standing their ground here to try to fight for this relationship. Okay, so past mistakes, they may have cheated in the past. Someone may be communicating to a king of swords that they want to reconcile. So you feel like the relationship was toxic. Well, let's go over this. Unfinished business. There's a connection here that's deeper than, than one realizes if it's a twin. Because you have the pre-empress energy there. But you're at a crossroads because you feel like there's toxicity there. You don't want to get your heart broken again. You don't, have, you don't want to have regrets and have your heart broken again. There may be a third party in the mix. So that third party may be the one causing the problems here. If it's a twin, if it's not, then you can remain single because of this. What does a collective need to know? See, you're taking a chance to reconcile a family because the magnetic attraction is under the bottom. There's a family and you're taking a risk to reconcile it. You may have children with this person. Somebody's trying to be patient, but they're having sleepless nights. It could be an emperor energy. Pre-empress, you may be thinking about, you know, this is trapped in your head, sleepless nights. Emperor and pre-empress are sitting side by side here. There's love here. There is love. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Still holding on. King of Wands will be the emperor in a lower vibration. Needing to heal. Needing to recover. Truth is, this person needs to master their emotions. And apologize. Walk away from what's, what's hidden. Who's going to see you working on this? You have the third party. Where you had no equal give and take watching you have this new beginning. There, you're working King of Swords on, on a commitment. They can see that you're working. The harsh truth is this third party is what? They're waiting. They're, they're soul searching, wanting justice to rush in. This person's going to try to come in and cause more drama. 
Under the bottom of the deck, you have the Seven of Cups. It's been going on for a long time. They want somebody left out in the cold. That's their wish fulfillment. So this person still, okay, it's risky to reconcile this because that third party is still up to no good. You know who needs to stop this is the masculine energy. They need to get in that King of Swords mode and slay the dragon. You got divine intervention. You got single. That could be the pre empress energy. You got home finances and legal matters. I feel like this is about you needing to be where you need to be. If you're in a situation where you need to divorce somebody or this is a divorce that needs to go through, there's legal matters, uh, like home and finances have to be split and legal matters here. That looks like to me would be like a divorce with home finances and legal matters for you to be single divine intervention. Somebody is trying to get away from somebody. They're trying to close the cycle. They're trying to close the cycle. This person wants to be with somebody else. They're taking their cup elsewhere. They're manifesting their emotions, mastering their emotions to move on. Somebody's heartbroken trying to hold on to the relationship. Secretly needing strength. Queen of Pentacles. So this person doesn't like that you're leaving them. Um, you're leaving for a reason though. Someone's trying to recover, trying to block the Queen of Swords. Now, the Queen of Swords was the one that I saw was the one who was trying to block before. Here's the thing. I don't know who, if you're getting the divorce because of this person trying to pull you to them, because that could be a possibility. Okay. This person's trying to pull you away from your family. Now, I feel like the home and finance and legal matters, you may even be going through a divorce with your partner because of a third party interference. And you're thinking about reconciling the relationship with your partner. But you have somebody here trying to block this it's a queen of swords queen of wands it's a third party i feel like for you that they're trying to play mind games and manipulate you to leaving your your family, your your wife, your commitment. But they're telling the Empress to be patient. Be patient. There will be you will be working on this commitment.
this person may have been it's illuminating the deception that somebody juggled somebody from their past so you do have a past person like they they had an ex before you that they may have cheated on you with, uh, cheated on you with this ex this ex is the person who is causing all the drama in this situation so pay attention to that so guys i'm going to leave it there if that resonates with you please leave me a comment down below don't forget to like share and subscribe and i hope you have a blessed week Thank you.